Dr. Nicole Friels here. I have a really neat case I wanted to share with you um, because this gentleman came in for toenail fungus. He's a diabetic. What else we got? High blood pressure. Oh, okay. high blood pressure. We've got calluses. But when I looked around the corner here to his little toe, really concerning seeing this black streak here. So what we're going to do is numb up the toe, remove the nail and biopsy that area. Sometimes it's just dried blood. That's our best case scenario. You know, it is the fifth toe. It's bumping up against the shoe. It's, I mean, it definitely could be a possibility, but the biggest thing that we want to um, make sure it is not is a melanoma, which is a little cancer and it happens underneath the toenail. I will tell you, if you have darker skin, um, you know, you can get pigmentation picked up if you have a mole at the cuticle area and the pigment from the mole picks up throughout the nail plate itself. So it's not a melanoma either, it's just the skin pigmentation. So nonetheless, better be safe than sorry. So we're gonna get it numbed up here and then we will get, I'm gonna move you over just a bit if you don't mind, perfect. This is the hard part, you'll feel a little cold spraying and bee sting, alrighty? And you can just relax that foot for me. Sounds like he's got a little bit of neuropathy, some numbness and burning from the diabetes, so you might not feel this as much. Here comes the cold spray. Okay, quick little stick. There we go. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, good. You've not kicked me, so, so far so good. Okay. A little more on that side. We don't want you feeling anything. Doing great. Do you guys have any questions for me? No. All right. So Alex is gonna go over how you're gonna take care of this, but just to kind of give you a general idea, you'll soak it every day and sprinkle a little collagen uh, wound powder in there, it looks like snow, and keep it covered. And we need to get you an excuse for tomorrow. Let's get started. I'll check it first, make sure you don't feel anything. How's that? Wrong. Good. If you change your mind, you let me know. So do you like watching the, all the videos? No. Okay, so let's free this up. Good. Okay. The way that toes position is kind of laying on its side. I'm gonna have to Get a little different angle here. Doing okay? No, I was nervous. Are <laughs> you nervous? I'm gonna twist your foot around just a little bit so I can get a better view here. Well, don't be nervous. The hard part's over. Now, what I really wanna do is look at the skin underneath and we'll flip that nail over and take a look together to see if there's discoloration in there. Okay, good. All right, here we go. So I'm seeing a lot of discoloration in the nail, uh -huh. which is a good sign that it's likely just um, some dried blood under there. But I'm gonna go ahead and send it and do a small little biopsy on that area because it's possible there's some a little bit of pigmentation under there. Specimen one. And these toes like to bleed. So right here, little punch biopsy. It's about three millimeters there. I wish I had some pickups, but let's see what we can do. Getting underneath here. There we go. He's going to pop right out. So that small amount, we're going to send this to the lab, and they're going to be able to make sure there's nothing of concern in there. Gently. There we go. Specimen number two. Now it's time to get everything wrapped up. 
All right. Oh yeah, no stitches. It's just a small little hunch biopsy, okay. very, very small. Now these little toes, they're a lot of fun to wrap with this. <laughs> So you're going to go home and get off of this for me. Take it easy. And as a diabetic, just to let you know, your first priority coming in to the office, any emergencies, we're going to give you a private text number that you can text us during the day um, that someone can get you in same day one of our doctors, and we've got four here. All right, everybody, well, thanks for watching. Don't forget, subscribe to the channel, comment below if you're concerned about one of your toenails, post it below, and I'll let you know what I think. All right, see you soon.